guys, welcome back to a brand new video. I'm finally sitting down and filming this long overdue haul. This is everything I spent my Christmas money on and what I got in the Christmas sales. Um, plus a gift that I got for myself for Christmas because I always do and some presents from Lily. It's the 29th of January so I am quite late filming it. I would just come on and film this video. So let's do the presents from Lily. So I got these when I went back to work probably the 6th 6th or 7th of January so I'd completely forgotten but she grabbed me this pouch from B&M I actually picked it up for myself in B&M I didn't realise till literally just now it's got a little gemstone on the little zipper and it says January and it's a birthstone pouch not sure what I'm going to use this for but I love these kind of type of little bags they're always really handy um, especially when you go travelling when you go on holiday and then inside it says imaginative generous and independent so in there she got me my favorite radox mineral therapy and moisture shower gel this is my favorite of all time not just radox um blended with minerals herbs chamomile and jojoba oil shower cream she got the big one 500 ml i love this absolutely love that and then she got me a selection of different masks with my presents from lee i'll do my present to myself it's a strange one i've been looking at getting this for a while well ever since leeds um it's actually brand new i didn't know it was brand new i've been trying to get it for a good price and it is cards against humanity um i hate playing this game because i get really embarrassed but I played this a few years ago at my Christmas weekend away. It was so fun. I had such a laugh. And then Leeds with the girls. Oh my God, crying with laughter. Um, so I've picked this up. I believe I only paid 15 99 which is really good. I did not realise it was brand new. So yeah, a strange one. But I bought myself Cards Against Humanity for Christmas. So from Poundland, I got two things in the sale. So I got the Land of Nod eye mask and pillowcase set. So I don't need these. I might just take that to work to be fair because it's quite a flimsy one. I didn't buy it for this. I bought it for the pillowcase. So David has these. He got a set of two from Amazon and I'm not sure if I'll like it. So I bought this and it was two pounds, I believe, um, for both. So yeah i'll take that to work put that in my work bag now these have such good health benefits with your hair and skin so i'm gonna try it out the only thing david said with his is um it's really cold to sleep on so i'll see how i get on and this one is a very strange one as you can see it's been in storage for a while in my wardrobe i got this relax glass sand timer relax unwind and drift away and my nan was like so why did you get it um it's a 60 minute timer and one i just really like the way it looks it's gray and glass so it'll really fit in with my living room area i could do this like in the evenings turn it over and have an hour reading or an hour self-care or our scrapbooking something for me um i probably will forget to use it but I think it'll look nice on the bookshelves and um, yeah I've wanted it for a few years and it's normally a fiver and I think it was down to three pounds so I was like I'm just gonna grab it. I made an order on boots and I think this was actually this is before Christmas because everything went in their sale really early so I grabbed this this was seven pounds fifty and it is the soap and glory mask force um i love face masks so it comes with speed plump miracle moisture mask bright and beautiful brightening mask what appealing declog peel mask and puffy eye attack absolutely love love face masks and i love soap and glory i also got this this is the soap and glory hydration station meant to be 20 pound i paid a tenner um and this is the set i got so it's got the peaches and clean deep cleansing milk which i really really rate i haven't actually got it at the minute but i really do rate that to take your makeup off i'm currently using the body shop one and a lizelle one face mask day lotion which i've never used and a hydrating jelly mist which i've never used before so i'm intrigued to try these out um 
but I really got it for the cleansing milk. And then I get this every single year. This is a Soap and Glory Home is Where the Spa is and these are all the things you get in it. So you get a vitamin C facial face wash. I use that every single day. I've actually got one in the bathroom now, one in the cupboard and this will be the third but I do use it every single day. Two face masks, a shower puff, Heal Genius, the Righteous Butter, which I have got one on the go at the minute, Clean On Me Body Wash, Scrub Of Your Life, I use that every time I'm in the bath, um, Hand Cream, which I use every single time I wash my hands at work because I notice just how dry my hands are at the minute. Got a Speed Plump Day Lotion in here as well, so I'll have two, so hopefully I'll get on with it. A Magnify Cocoa Body Lotion and a body wash. I might use the body wash, but I'm not that much of a fan for coconut. I'll see how I get on. If not, I can just give that to my sister, the body lotion. So happy that I got that. That leads me on to my little order on Lush. I love Lush. I love bath bombs. And at nine o'clock in the morning, Boxing Day, I went on the website and I managed to get three box sets. So one, two, three. So they were all half price. This one is called Christmas Bath Time Favourites and you get Snow Fairy Bath Bomb, Moon Bath, Sweet Pudding, Partridge in a Pear Tree, Snow Drift, Shoot for the Stars, Crystal Snow Bath and Twilight Bath Bomb, which I absolutely love. Snow Fairy and Twilight are probably my favourites. £48, so it was £24. Little one here, Christmas Candy Box. So in here you get Candy Cane Bubble Bar, Snow Fairy Wand Bubble Blower, which I've never had before. My sister's had it. Snow Fairy Bath Bomb, Sweet Pudding, Butter Bear and creamy candy bubble bar so i'm glad you get some bubble bars in that one and that one was 35 pound so it was 17 pound 50 i believe so this one was meant to be 27 pounds it's the snow fairy box set and it's got snow fairy bath bomb snow fairy bubble bar which i just used my last one um 100 gram snow fairy shower gel and then the body lotion in there so yeah i'm hoping to just empty the two small ones into the big one because i've got a drawer in my bathroom full of bath bombs at the minute so i didn't need any more but that will definitely see me through the year so i bought them on boxing day and i saw amber the 28th maybe and she was like oh i've been on lush i didn't manage to get anything i was like oh i i managed to on boxing day she's like i tried and i tried and she was like, did you get the candle? I was like, no, I completely forgot. Did you get the wax melts? No, I forgot. Luckily, I kept going back on and back on because I managed to get a large Snow Fairy candle. It's a four wick. This is amazing. I don't know if this was new for 2022. I'm not sure but Snow Fairy is my favourite. I'm so glad to now have it out of the box and showing you guys because I can put it in my room. I've changed the room around um, and in the evenings with the lights on it, it looks so cosy. So I'm so glad to have this out. I don't want to burn it though because it smells amazing. This should have been £35, but I got it for £17.50. as everything that I picked up in the December and January sales. Um, and I spent my Christmas money on all of this so I need to now go and pop it all away so thank you guys for watching please like comment and subscribe and stick around for more videos bye